Welcome back. You're watching the SABC News Channel this Saturday afternoon. Great to have you with us. Well, the small rural community in the Western Cape is indeed breaking new ground. On this case, water in a sustainable farming project. The Sierra Bra community near Swellendam is embarking on aquaponic farming. Fish fertilize the water, which in turn provides nutrients to the crops. It uses 90% less water than traditional farming. Let's take a look. Sierra a small secluded village buckling under poverty and unemployment. Now thrown a lifeline, aquaponics. Relatively new to South Africa, experts believe the recirculating water system is the key to a sustainable farming model. Water is continuously being cleaned and reused. Aquaculture, which is fish farming, and you combine that with hydroponics, which is growing uh, your produce in a water source. Um, currently, we haven't uh, we haven't decided on what fish to use here. We're looking at what all the endemic species are currently in this area, so we don't run into any trouble through permitting. Um, so currently, some of the species we're looking at is barbel, black bass, um, carp. Those are the things that they have currently in the river. Locals are being skilled to manage the farm and generate an income. We want to be the project to be sustainable and we want to create uh, jobs for the woman that is participating in the project here in Seabrook. We are six women that is going to be working here and the duties of the women will be different because we also have a nursery here. So two of the women will be working in the nursery and they will maintain the nursery. They will make sure that we have enough seating so that we can bring the seatings into the aquaponic system. The local water authority has invested 200,000 rand in the project. In this one is a, is a perfect example to make more of water, to close the water loop and also to bring benefits to the community. There's also a lot of science behind this project and I think it's for everybody a learning curve and hopefully it's the way forward for, for many other communities in the country. During its pilot stages, the project will concentrate on salad vegetables. It's hoped that it will be expanded in the next few months. Segui Chetty, SABC News, Seerbrak, in the Overberg District in the Western Cape.